This video will demonstrate how to connect to the Wavelink's wireless area controller's internal web pages. The internal web pages allow for access to advanced administrative functions. Access the web pages using any computer that has wireless capability and a compatible web browser. To connect to a wireless area controller that is still in its factory default configuration, locate the label on the front plate of the controller and take note of the MAC ID. Next, make sure that the computer's Wi-Fi is active. Scroll through the Wi-Fi networks and select the network that begins with the word Eaton, followed by the MAC ID that was on the front of the wireless area controller. The last number will be one digit higher than the original MAC ID noted. When prompted, type in the password as it appears on the screen, matching case exactly, and then selecting the necessary options to make the connection. Once the network is connected, open a web browser window. In the web browser's address bar, type in the IP address of the wireless area controller. For wireless area controllers still in the default state, the IP address should be 192.168.100.1. The browser window may display a warning regarding the site security certificate. Locate the option in the browser to bypass or continue. When prompted to log in, enter the username and password as shown on the screen, matching case exactly before selecting the login button. If login is successful, the browser will display the system web page. The connection to the wireless area controller web pages is complete. Repeat these steps anytime administration tasks are necessary.